Hi there, my name is Vince from MyMateVince.com and today I'm going to show you how to easily boost your Wi-Fi signal. Now, if you're close to your router, normally the Wi-Fi signal is strong, but as soon as you start moving away from that point, the signal gets weaker and weaker and you might have some rooms in the house that barely get a signal at all. You might be watching Netflix, the quality might be poor, or you might be watching YouTube and it might keep buffering. So by using Powerline adapters, these Wi-Fi booster ones, you can solve that problem. It will be similar to being next to your router, whatever room that you have this booster in. Now in this particular pack, this is the TP-Link pack, you get one power line adapter and one Wi-Fi booster. This was £45. You can also get another pack that has another Wi-Fi booster. So if you had two dead spots in the house, then you could plug one into one of them, another into the other one, and that particular pack was roughly around £65. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a speed test using speedtest.net right here now because I'm close to my router and then I'm going to go up to the back bedroom upstairs because I know the signal's poor in the back bedroom and I'm going to do another speed test there and hopefully it should be dramatically reduced and then I'm going to set up these power line adapters and hopefully the signal upstairs should be similar to the signal down here. Now I've really done a very long video on these power line adapters but basically they use the electric wiring in your house so it's kind of like having a, a wired connection but it's using an ethernet connection, but it's actually using the electric cables that are already in the wall in your house, so you don't have to run any cables. They're really simple to do. You just plug them in, setting them up takes a few minutes. Uh, these ones are already set up, so when I plug them in, they will automatically sync up. So let's just do a quick speed test. I'm gonna be using speedtest.net for my speed test. This is a, a, an iPod 6, sixth generation, and this is an Android phone. So we'll just go to speed test and speed test, test and test, just to see what we're getting here. The signal should be good down here because we're right next to the router. As you can see, it's roughly 50 meg. Okay, so on this one here it's 51 down and 5 up, and this one here is 42 down and near enough 5 up again. Okay, 42, 5. So there is a very, there is a, there is a variation between the two. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to uh, turn the video off, go upstairs, take another speed test result. Okay, so we're upstairs in the back bedroom now. I'm just going to do a, a test again, and we should see a lower, a lower speed. Okay, you can see it's dramatically lower. I'm not even getting one meg. So this was 50 meg downstairs, and up here it's only 0.33 meg, so it's kind of unusable. The apple was 0.4 meg. Just doing the upload now. Uploads is actually uh, higher on the upload than the download. Okay, so you can see connections all for up here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to uh, go uh, go back downstairs and I'm going to plug in the power line adapter and then bring the Wi-Fi booster up here and then we'll do another speed test and hopefully we should get speed similar to the uh, 40 and 50 meg that we've seen downstairs. Okay so I've now connected up the power line adapter, plugged it into the mains, you've got the ethernet cable feeding my, feed my router, okay and the other end if we just run upstairs, I've plugged the Wi-Fi booster into this point here. This is the back bedroom that I have the problems in, so I thought I'd plug it here because both of the back bedrooms I do have a very weak signal. So this is the other one here, just plug straight into the power socket in the wall, no cables attached to it. And now if we do a speed test again, we should find the a bit of speed. 
OK, speed test. Test again. Test again. Now, before we weren't even getting one meg. And as you can see, that's jumped straight up to about 38 meg. The, uh, what's the Apple one doing? It's creeping up bit by bit. It's a 22 meg. So the, uh, the Android phone is 37 meg and 5 meg up. And the Apple is 22 meg down and 5 meg up. So it's not as good as if we were next to the router, but remember, I'm a, a short distance away from it now. You know, it's there. But uh, as you can see, it's a lot better. It's a lot better than it was. So if you, uh, if you want these power line adapters, then please check out my website. That's www.mymatevince.com. And then what I'll do is I will link to Amazon sellers that sell them. They're really good. TP, TP link. Okay, thanks a lot for watching. Take care. Bye now.